season's education. Hello, Onisan. We have you loud and clear. Here, Minister of Education, Culture, Sports, Science and Technology, Hayashi. Uh, together with us, more than 400 people gathered for ISF2 here in Tokyo to talk about the important issues for future of the international uh, cooperation for space exploration. Uh, as you three uh, in the team, international team, uh, I really would like to ask you the, how you feel with your experience, what's the importance of international cooperation in space exploration? Thank you, Mr. Uh, Hayashi. And uh, international cooperation is sometimes challenging because of the language barriers, time differences among space centers, or even the differences uh, of the ways of thinking. And you can see our crew is very diverse. The cosmonaut from Russian Federation, the NASA astronaut from the United States, and uh, Uchu Hikoshi from Japan. <laughs> and uh, uh, that, that diversity is uh, no problem for us. So we are working together in harmony every day. No problem, no fighting. <laughs> and uh, even that diversity makes our mission much more efficient and uh, creative. We can solve technical issues or we can overcome difficulties because of the diversity. We have different ideas, different sets of skills. We have different experiences. And uh, yes, the international cooperation is difficult, but in my opinion, it's worth it. And uh, we together, not individuals from different countries, but as a humankind, working together in the space station. 20 years of operation of the ISS is the, a good example how human beings working together regardless of differences of races, uh, religions, and cultures. That's the beauty of the ISS program. My question is, in what ways can space exploration improve the daily life of civilians living on Earth? Thank you very much for your good question. Uh, here on orbit we do a lot of scientist experiments every day. Uh, for example, we monitoring our planet from space and we can see how people, how our Earth uh, uh, getting worse every day, unfortunately. And uh, we can see from here, from space. If you get an opportunity to start a new business related to a deep space exploration, what would you like to do? Well, it's a very difficult question to answer because I'm just an astronaut, not a business person. <laughs> but uh, I would suggest maybe a deep space communication technology. It makes our future mission much more efficient safer and uh, more productive and uh, you know the space is very innovative place uh, on board the, the international space station we every day we test develop many many cutting edge technologies literally it's a very new technologies we are testing every day and uh, in the future, in the future mission, as many or more uh, people get involved in the space program, uh, we get, we will have uh, much more innovative, interesting ideas from that, and uh, that innovations will make our society better place. Uh, first, I would like to say thank you. It's been an honor to participate in your uh, program today. Um, it's, uh, it's inspiring for us to hear all of the great questions and to feel all of the interest coming out of your organization. It uh, is truly an honor. The other thing is 
that uh, a lot of the questions highlighted some things, that, challenges that are very difficult, they're very complex. But keep doing what you're doing because those barriers will get broken down and we're going to have a stronger and stronger space program. And uh, we will all together dream big. <laughs> First of all, I want to say thank you so much for good questions. I'm proud, uh, like commander of the International Space Station, to have a chance to sense my uh, greeting from space. The space program has been inspiring people all over the world. And uh, the support from these people make us bring uh, this stage where the humankind has been continuously living space for 20 years. I, th I think this is uh, one of the greatest achievement in the mankind history. And uh, I would say uh, thank you so much for having us. And uh, uh, I wish uh, your uh, happiness and uh, successful in the future space exploration. Thank you so much. Now we are going to close the communication event. But before that, uh, if you guys uh, show us some demonstration of microgravity, that would be appreciated. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much for your